Pinag-usapan daw tayo sa department. Why? Wala naman tayong ginagawa masama. Wala naman tayong sinasak ng tao. Please think, sir. Hello guys, today we're going to review the movie About Us but Not About Us from director Jun Lana. But before we continue, don't forget to hit that like button, share this video, comment, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell so you'll be updated when new content comes out. I entered About Us but Not About Us with my eyebrows raised. I knew that the whole movie will only be a conversation involving two people. While it is possible to have a whole movie about a conversation, it would really be hard to pull off. One would have to channel the dialogue skills of Quentin Tarantino to make the movie interesting and keep the audience's attention. You also need a compelling reason why we should care to listen. And you need gifted actors to pull off the task. With About Us but Not About Us, we get all that is required to make the movie work. We see two individuals, Romnik Sarmienta, playing Eric, a literature professor who had a partner die and has to live with the guilt, and paired with him is Elijah Canlas, playing Lancelot, a writing major whom Eric helps by letting Lance use his condominium. The two agree to meet at a restaurant and they talk about their relationship as mentor and mentee. They also talk about the death of Eric's lover and how the death affected both of them. During the course of the conversation, secrets are revealed and what was supposed to be a normal conversation turns into an interrogation, a confessional, and a negotiation which turns the world of Eric upside down. Director Jun Lana succeeds with this very risky movie. Supposedly, the movie is very personal to the director as he draws from his experiences from the writing world and he gets to reveal the dark underbelly of the academe. Lana skillfully takes the audience on this roller coaster of a conversation that will make a listening audience grip their armrest as we see enthralling moments marked by riveting dialogue. It is a good thing that Lana got gifted actors to play his characters. Elijah Canlas exudes a vulnerable but sleazy manipulative aura that perfectly suited his role. His side glances and little smiles often revealing a person that is much different from what Eric faces. Romney Charmiento, on the other hand, is the meat in this meal. He certainly deserves his acting award as he takes us on a journey of various emotions and we feel exactly what he is thinking and feeling with a very nuanced acting job that will likely get the attention of other award-giving bodies. If we get a Romney Sons like what Brandon Fraser got, I wouldn't be surprised and I would be glad. Romney Sarmienta got trapped by a love team during his early years and it is a good development for the industry that he finally got to show his acting chops beyond the confines of a teeny bopper environment. This is a brave film that tackles issues of gender identity and art. I came from the world which the movie discussed and I saw personally the issues that were mentioned. In those writing workshops and consultations, there is actually a negotiation and battle going on among artists which is not for those who are faint-hearted. To survive, to fight, and to be awarded, one has to steal one's nerves and often play politics. Sadly, in these metaphorical battles, integrity often is the casualty. I have seen senior artists take advantage of inexperienced artists and fans for their own gain. I have seen awards devalued because of political considerations. I have seen writing workshops turn into clone-making factories for old writers a mutual masturbation society both figuratively and literally. About Us but Not About Us is spellbinding cinema. It takes theater conventions that should not work in film but succeeds because of the skill of the people involved. This film is not for those with the attention span of goldfish as one needs to listen intently to the conversation to catch clues. And those who do will be rewarded well. This movie deserves more viewers as it shows that one doesn't need bombastic action or screaming gaze to create a fulfilling movie watching experience. For an industry long plagued by the curse of the usual, with about us but not about us, I can only say about time. So that's the review for about us but not about us. This has been Kulas for Tambe Reviews. Thank you for watching. Keep on playing.